<laughs> oh, what are you wearing, Hank? My new swim trunks, Ralph. Makes me feel like I'm on the sandy beaches of Hawaii, instead of working. Got you a pair, too, in green. Uh, thanks? Hi, guys. My dad says you're almost done. Almost. We had eight steel beams before that last delivery, right, Hank? You know it, boss. And in that last delivery of beams, we got... Uh-oh, I didn't get the number of beams that were just dropped in the bin. And I need that for my report. I only know that we have 19 in total. That sounds like a word problem. Sure, a word problem, of course. And Ralph here, he knows all about word problems. Don't you, Ralph? Me? Word problems? Maybe I can help? Aw, oh, that would be amazing. You're a real lifesaver, Jesse. So we know that you started with eight beams. And that crane just dropped some more in the bin, making it 19 beams altogether. When you end up with more than you started with, that's addition. I'm going to write a number sentence. Since we know we're supposed to add, let's start with this. Now we need to figure out the missing numbers. You started with eight beams. So let's put the number eight in the first space. The next thing we do is ask ourselves, what else do we know? Well, we also know there's a total of 19 beams in the bin. Since it's the total, that number goes after the equal sign. Because we don't know how many the crane added, we'll put a question mark there. That stands for the missing number. See, we've changed our word problem to a number sentence. Now let's solve it. One strategy for solving number sentences is to use a number family. 19 goes at the top because it's the biggest number. Eight goes in the bottom left corner. And a question mark goes in the bottom right corner. Do we have to build that triangle? If so, we're going to need more beams. Of course we don't. Um, do we? <laughs> nope. The triangle just helps us see the number family. Now, I'm going to write out the four facts that go with this number family. Okay. Eight plus question mark equals 19. Question mark plus eight equals 19. 19 minus question mark equals eight. 19 minus eight equals question mark. Hey, look at the last number sentence. What does it tell us? Um, you have nice writing? Thank you. But look, 19 minus eight. We can solve that number sentence. 19 minus eight equals 11. The missing number in our number family is 11. And that means the crane delivered 11 beams. You're sure about that? Let's check. You started with eight beams this morning, and that crane just dropped some more in the bin for a total of 19 beams. To check your answer, you put the missing number in the first number sentence. Does eight plus 11 equal 19? Yes, we have the right answer. All right. Thanks, Jesse. Let's get this job done, Hank. Ready, guys? Hey, Dad, remember to take off your hard hat. Nah, we're good. Oh, we don't want to get our hair wet.